himself, his rhythm with his jazz team. Spent most of his career with the Memphis Grizzlies. Close out by Gobert, does not matter. Contested three by Horford, and he rips the cords. Still got a flyby. SGA straight away, wants the three, and got the three. SGA killed just Alexander. You know he's going to be playing with a lot of confidence. Front defensively is Horford, eyes another three. And an early scoring spree for Oklahoma City out of the gate. Quarter number three here in downtown Oklahoma City. There's a turnover by Utah. George Hill is trying to start the break, but Utah got back defensively. You see that screen set by Horford, and how about Hill hip to hip with O'Neal? Did not matter, scoops it up off the glass. So he, he, for the Jazz to take the four-point lead. Hill, and we get a whistle on his baseline drive and a foul. That, that, that whistle was a little bit late, but you know, I don't have a problem with that as long, as long as it's the correct whistle. I was talking about at halftime defensively. You did a great job in that first half. But this Jazz team just keeps coming at you. A tough layup there. George Hill not deterred at all by the presence of they're trying to run the floor here. Basley right hand. No. Hill the put back. Counted in a foul. As the relentless effort for the Thunder. Capped off by Hill on the putback will earn him a trip to the line. And, and I like the idea of just pushing the pace of this ball game again, not allowing the Jazz to set up. And look what happens. The smallest guy from the Thunder gets an and one. Hill drives again, scoops it up, and somehow got it to bounce in. He took a lot of contact on that play as well. It's in the quarter. Just, just real slithery move right there. Almost lost his balance. Still had enough English on that ball to drop it in. SGA slips it underneath and a no-look reverse right-handed layup by George Hill, who has a series of layups tonight with a high degree of difficulty. That, that, that's a guy that's had the basketball in his hand a lot during his career. By Hill rescues the possession. Dort left wide open for three and knocks it down. What a play by Mitchell. Under 10, Mitchell drives, floats, hangs, and banks it in. And Utah got it into Horford. Horford tries to get rid of it, does so to SGA. SGA, pressure, double team, shot on the way, off the glass, and short. And Utah prevails 110-109 in this home opener. And what was a battle to the finish?